everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a classic July favorites video. And that's just essentially where I'm going to be telling you guys about some of my favorite products that I used in the month of July. Now it doesn't just have to be beauty products, it can be really anything that you used a lot of or enjoyed in the month of, in this case, July. So let's get into the video. Okay, so the first thing that I have is this Bath & Body Works um, Black Cherry Merlot Candle. I am a big fan of candles. Um, I pretty much switch to a different candle each month. And so in the month of July, this is the one that I have really been enjoying. I don't know why, but for some reason wine in general reminds me of summer. And this is the one that I have really been enjoying um, this month. The next thing is this Health Aid Kombucha, and this is in Pink Lady Apple. Now, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not super picky about kombucha. I really enjoy like all flavors of it, but this specifically, this one is really good. It kind of tastes like apple cider. Even my boyfriend tried it, who he doesn't really like kombucha that much, and he said that this one wasn't bad. But yeah, this one is delicious in my opinion, and it's also very healthy as well. The next thing is this Faux Era Full Coverage Long Wear Liquid Foundation, and I talked about this a little bit in my foundation routine. If you'd like to watch that, I'll link it down below. But I started using this in June, and I really just love it. The texture of it is like perfect for my skin. It somewhat resembles almost like a paint, which sounds a little weird, but when you put it on your skin, it's just very moisturizing. It goes on very like evenly. It has a really light feel on your face too, which is especially important for summer. I don't really like feeling like I have a bunch of stuff caked on my face when it's like hot outside and I'm sweating. So this one is really good for the summer season. The next product is this Sun Bum Heat Protectant, and it is a fairly natural heat protectant as well. It's vegan, paraben-free, uh, color-safe, cruelty-free, all of the important things. And it smells really good. It kind of has like a coconutty, like almost like a pina colada type smell. It's for all hair types, and I really do feel, I spray it specifically like on the bottom of my hair, and I really do feel like it helps protect um, from getting like split ends really quickly. The next product is the Ordinary High Adherence um, Silicone Primer, and this one is very moisturizing, which is part of the reason why I like it so much. I've tried some primers in the past that almost dry out my face a little bit. And this one just makes your face feel really smooth and makes all of your makeup go on nicely. And I love all of the Ordinary products, so this is definitely a great primer to use. Next is actually a book that I've been reading this month, which is The Silent Wife by ASA Harrison. This really isn't a long read. It's pretty easy to get through, and the chapters are very short, so it definitely like keeps your attention span but I just haven't had as much time to read as I would like. I used to be able to get through like a book every two weeks or maybe even every week, but now with school and YouTube and just the summer in general being very busy and very packed and you're trying to be outside all the time, I just haven't had as much time. So yes, I've been reading this book all month and no, I'm still not done with it, but essentially the book is about a couple who are living in Chicago and their marriage is just a little shaky. She finds out that he's cheating on her and things just go a little crazy from there. I don't wanna like spoil the whole book, but it's a good like fiction kind of, I wouldn't say mystery, but suspense type book. So definitely check this book out if you are looking for a good short read. The last product that I have been loving this month is the Wet Brush, and I don't know if you guys have ever tried these, but if you haven't and you have long hair, this is definitely the way to go. Especially in the summer when you get back from the beach and you want to brush your hair out or you get out of the shower. I mean, obviously it's called the Wet Brush, so it works really well with wet hair. And I also have like really curly, usually like curly tangly hair. And I have tried like different picks and combs and regular brushes and 
nothing works as easily as this. Uh, I don't really have to struggle at all to brush out my hair and it definitely doesn't feel like it's like ripping my hair out, which is the experience that I've had with some other like brushes and combs and such. So if you've never tried a wet brush, I would highly recommend checking it out. So those are my favorite products and things that I have been using in the month of July. I will link them all down below if you'd like to check them out. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to be notified about future videos, please hit that subscribe button below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!